Beyond Guam's northern, southern, eastern, and western coastlines lie hundreds of marine habitats where different types of sea life thrive in our warm waters and find refuge in our reef. However, when these precious environments are threatened, the animals that inhabit them suffer great consequences. During this episode, we learn more about marine preserves and what we can do to protect them. I'm Joanna Delphin, and this is Dig It. Marine preserves. Marine preserves are areas in which certain activities are restricted to protect coral reef habitats and aquatic animals. Jane Dia from the Guam Department of Agriculture, Division of Aquatics and Wildlife Resources, showed us one of five marine preserves on island in the village of Piti. A marine preserve is just another management tool, a tool to um, maybe just control the fish stocks so that there's always a replenishing, always having um, um, fish reproducing and so the marine preserves the benefits that it has is that it allows fish to grow in an area without being um, you know preyed upon without being uh, harvested so then they could grow um, bigger to the size they need to reproduce the marine preserve is like a safe place for them to have their um, their spawning seasons um, but also it protects the whole ecosystem. There's seagrass habitat, there's the, so many various habitats in a, in a marine preserve. So in the beginning, um, you know, Guam didn't have marine preserves and at some point fishermen were really realizing that we had a really drastic reduction in fish population, fish stock. And so um, the government decided to, to set up five marine preserves as a tool. <laughs> Guam's five marine preserves, Paddy Point, Tumon Bay, Petey Bombholes, Sasa Bay, and Achang Reef are home to hundreds of species of fish and invertebrate such as starfish, balati or sea cucumbers, and octopi. Their protection is vital to ensuring future generations are able to enjoy these sea creatures in their natural habitat. The benefits of marine preserves that we found out though is that businesses and residents, families can come and enjoy more fish in a marine preserve such as Tumon Bay Preserve. And so businesses um, have grown, so they take out tourists to see all these beautiful um, underwater sea life and habitats. They're all interconnected. So when you protect the fisheries and where the fish will spawn later, then you're protecting the whole island. So one of the main goals of our PD Pride to Pokin Wide um, campaign is to teach people what they can do when they're in the water. You know, how they can contribute to protecting the sea life and the, um, animal, the fish habitat. <music> Petey Pride is Tapugan wide, and the name is because Tapugan is the name of this bay. As environmental stewards, we need to take an active stand to keep our preserves, sea life, and reefs protected. Though we cannot predict the effects Mother Nature can have on these precious habitats, we can work together to prevent man-made disasters from occurring, such as coral bleaching, removal of sea life from the ocean, and damage to our coral. We wanted people not to look at marine preserves like, oh, we can't do these things. We can't fish, we can't harvest. We wanted people to see it as a chance to participate in keeping it a place for fish to um, spawn, a place where fish can grow and different animals can come in. Conservation officers from the Guam Department of Agriculture frequently monitor activity at the preserves. However, efforts to curb damage is everyone's responsibility. If you see suspicious activity at any of Guam's preserves, contact the department's hotline at 688-DAWR. That's 688-3297. One of the reasons why Guam really needs community help and effort to keep it pristine is because we continue to have visitors and new people coming to Guam and so it's important to know where your marine preserves are, it's important to know the benefits of marine preserves, um, and also how to take care of it. So Jane, thank you so much for joining us today and talking to us about what P Pride Tabugan Wide is all about and 
uh, why it's important for us to preserve our reefs and our sea life. Is there anything you'd like to say to our viewers? Sure. First of all, thank you so much for having me. I enjoyed this time to just share what I know and what we've been doing here at PD. Um, just if you can remember 688-DAWR-3297, call if you see anything that would be helpful and um, enjoy, enjoy Guam. Thank you, Guam, for joining us for this episode. We'll see you during our next segment. But in the meantime, feel free to let us know, did, did you, you dig it? it?